But what would you consider, let's take the decade, to be the top two or three issues that have hit us as it concerns the doctrine of the end times here in uh, the last decade? Well, Jan, there are so many uh, because we're just seeing uh, things fulfilled before. It's an exciting time. We're seeing prophecy fulfilled before our very eyes. And uh, I would just, uh, let me name three right quickly uh, mm -hmm. that uh, jump out at me, but uh, uh, it, it just depends on the person you ask. I, I would say, uh, first and foremost, is what's going on in Israel. Uh, mm -hmm. There are many, many prophecies about Israel in the end times. There are four that I think are the most important. One is the regathering of the Jews from the four corners of the earth. The second is the reestablishment of the state. The third is the reconquering of the city of Jerusalem, all of which occurred in the 20th century. Now, the final of those four, the one, the last prophecy mentioned before the tribulation begins, is the one that's occurring right now mentioned in Zechariah 12, and that's the whole world will come together yeah. against Israel mm -hmm. over the issue of Jerusalem, and that is exactly where we are. The whole world is coming together against uh, Israel over Jerusalem, including the United States of America. Uh, the Vatican is saying, give it to them and let them uh, run it. Uh, the United Nations is saying, give it to them and let them internationalize it. The Arabs are saying they want all of it. The United States is saying, let's divide it and give half to the Arabs and half to the Jews. That the whole world is coming together. And to me, this is one of the most important prophecies we're seeing fulfilled before our very eyes. Yeah. A second one I would mention occurred in December of 2009, and that was when the European Union adopted a constitution and ceased to be simply a economic union and now has become a political union, and uh, uh, which uh, is verified by the fact that just recently, about a week ago, they uh, petitioned the United Nations to give them special uh, uh, attention in the United Nations with special votes in both the Security Council and in the uh, uh, United Nations General Assembly because they are now a superpower. So they are no longer just an economic entity, they are a political entity, and to me we are seeing the formation of the old uh, Roman Empire coming back together just as was prophesied by Daniel over 2,500 years ago. And I'm down to 30 seconds, David. Okay, and the third and final one I would mention is the one we've been talking about, yes. and that is the absolutely exponential yes. increase in apostasy in the church. Thank you. I, I would agree with you wholeheartedly. We'll talk more about these things again on October 8th, 9th. David, I want to thank you so much. Um, thank you for your, your ministry. Visit his website, lamblion.com, and sign up Stanley, for his... Stanley, I say that uh, I know you've got some surgery coming up soon, and I want to ask people mm -hmm. to pray for you, pray earnestly for you, pray for the doctors to have supernatural wisdom, for the surgery to be completely successful, thank you. and for you to be relieved of all pain. Thank you, folks. Hello, my name is Nathan Jones, web minister with Lamb and Lion Ministries. We're using the internet to proclaim the soon return of Jesus Christ to the over one billion people who access the internet now and after the rapture. I'd like to invite you to come and check out our website at www.lamblion.com. You will find a wealth of information about Bible prophecy, gaining a big picture view into God's plan for the ages and learn how His eternal plan relates to you in the here and now. Watch online episodes of Christ and Prophecy for in-depth teachings on end time events. Read from the library of articles covering all aspects of God's prophetic word. Subscribe free to receive the Lamplighter magazine, e-newsletter, and blog to stay up to date on current events as they relate to Bible prophecy. Equip yourself to share the good news with others using materials from our resource center. Come visit lamblion.com today.